It's been a while since we last caught up with UNA Volleyball head coach Bob White. The UNA Volleyball team's been on the road for a good while now. A long trip down to Florida, then a trip up to New Jersey, back home this past Sunday against North Florida. And Coach White, let's start right there. Five-set thriller to North Florida. Unfortunately, we come out on the losing end of that one. But how close was the team to getting that win against North Florida? We were, we were, I think we were close. I mean, we, um, we don't have – right now we don't have that – that one go-to player that that most of the conference has and and a game five you kind of set your rotation around that one player and and uh, our offense is more balanced right now which can be good in a, in a long and that's how we were able to stay with them for the first you know stay in the match and get it to five but you got to have that that player you really can help uh, put that game match away for you and and generally that's a senior and it was for them and so but to get to five and you know, that was a that was a, a nice accomplishment for this team and you know it's kind of the first half of the season and finished really strong in that last match and hopefully that'll propel us going into the second half of this conference. And coach, let's talk about this. Uh, eight matches in in conference play. Now we've seen every team at least once. Uh, what do we take away now as we head into the second half of conference play, where we'll see everybody for a second time? Well, I think we know what we have to do to be able to stop them. Um, that doesn't necessarily mean that we will. Um, they, you know, as far as the talent level, we've we've pretty much gone through. Like I said we've gone through everybody, and 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 there's some key positions that we 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 can't match up and I think what we have to do in those positions is where we where we don't have the block maybe to stop a key player up front we're gonna have to dig a little bit better on the back row and so we've been working on some things we changed up quite a bit of things before we played on Sunday and um, and that worked well for us and we've been working hard on on those changes uh, since that time and so it's we're kind of a new look going into the second half. And, of course, those other teams can do the same thing, so you never know. But at least you know who the players are you have to stop and what you have to do to stop them. And, and it helps you set goals, you know, if, if, the, if the player that, that hurt you the last time hit 300, you know, if you can hold her to 200, you know, so you have some, you know, uh, tangible goals that we can set out there that we didn't have before. All right, Coach, next up on Friday, you guys will take on Kennesaw State on the road. Then you'll come back home a few days off. Then Tuesday, we welcome Lipscomb into Flowers Hall. Both of those games will be able to be seen on the ESPN networks. Uh, Coach, two of the top teams in the conference, they played a five-set thriller on Wednesday night, I believe. But second time around against each of these two teams, what's the approach? Well, they're two of the top teams, and you know uh, our goal is to do just what would happen uh, on Sunday with University of North Florida. Just, just stay in the match. Um, we're not going to beat. We're not going to knock into these teams all three zero. You know, we've got to be able to stay in the match and 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 stay positive and be encouraged. And you lose game set one, come back and take game, set two. You know, it's kind of the flow that we had on Sunday, and and just know that I think we know that we can play with them. It's just we know that we, we can't blow them out, that kind of a situation. So we've got to stay in the match and try to get to a game five. That was our goal on Sunday. We, we kind of get, let's try to get to five, and, and generally anybody can win. Um, they just had the hotter hand in game five, and we got to uh, – and that's, that's kind of how we'll take it. We'll, look, we'll, we'll mat, try to match up as best as we can and, uh, and just do the best we can. North Alabama with two A-Sun matches this weekend, Friday night at Kennesaw, then Tuesday night taking on Lipscomb. We hope to see you out at Flowers Hall on Tuesday.